is up everyone, I'm here for a very sad update because I, I can't do this. Two videos a day? No. That's hard. It's very hard. It's just me working on this. I don't have any help at all. I can't multitask at all with life suddenly just piling new, new, new stuff on me. I Sorry guys, but as... Alright, let's just sort this out and think about it logically. Let me move the camera so I can set up. Alright, now, it was a very big surprise to me to find out that Magna Carta was getting more views than Star Fox Adventures. I thought Star Fox Adventures would be taking the bulk of the audience. I had no idea Magna Carta was such a very popular game. Problem is, I'm not getting too into it because I can only go 15 minutes per episode managing my time, making sure my camera doesn't die on me, which it has. Part 17, the camera dies at the very end. And going back into editing, I find out that halfway through part 17, the audio cuts out because the camera is dying. So I was doing a post commentary for that, but I also had 18 to do. What, what was I going to do a post commentary over in that one? I, I can't do a post commentary for shit, so I said, you know what, this is becoming too much to handle, and it's going to get to the point where I might not have enough time for YouTube. Not, I'm not saying that I'm ever going to close my YouTube account, because that's a horrible thing to do. That I still have content. I have about 350-something videos, and there are still people who occasionally come across them. Why would I close my account and just leave all, the, all those occasional people hanging? I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't do that to you guys, and I don't ever want to quit YouTube. So why the hell would I do that? It's just... But... I've been managing alright with one video a day. You've got to admit that I have done a damn good job when it comes to that. And it's been about half a year now. That's why I've been steadily climbing up that ladder of videos. I mean, half a year ago, I only had like... 180 videos over the course of two years. Now I've almost got, I've literally got 100, I pumped out 180 videos over about six months. That's really good. That's really good. And two videos a day? That's difficult. That's difficult. Because I take like one day, record one game, and render that game from the rest of that day to the next day. Until that entire session is rendered. The parts are set out and everything. Then I record the next game. Which would be Star Fox Adventures. I do more of that because it's easier to render, record and render. And then I will render that for the rest of that day. And then the next day and maybe a little bit of the day after that. Because I recorded more. Now you see the problem coming here. I have a bulk of one set. And not as much as the other. Because it takes this camera. Which only has an hour and a half battery. When the light's not on. And that's a bit of a hint. It kind of hinders me a little bit. But then there's also the case that this laptop is going 24-7. Another problem is arising. It can't take this. Like, right now, it's frozen. <laughs> Crap. I just closed Pinnacle because my laptop is nearly about to overheat. Like, if I stick my hand underneath this little setup I have right here, which is two Harry Potter books, the last two ones supporting this laptop up over my desk so it can so it can vent properly it's like a freaking oven I could bake bread underneath this thing so I have to give my laptop a break and that's making it hard to render videos now there's also time management that I have to start taking into a car because there have been times over summer where I'll go out and do things, but I've also been using this scheduling system like crazy. I can upload 10 videos in one day and have them set so that they will go, they will be published a certain day throughout the week. But my buffer is starting to run out and I am spending less and less time at this computer because one, I have to start practicing driving. I've been driving every day. I'm trying to get used to it. I'm trying to get used to my car. I've been trying to fix the damn thing because it has problems of its own and it needs 
corner lights that needs its turn signals fixed. There's just minor things that need fixing, oil change. That needs to be done. And then there'll be the actual DMV test where I actually take my test and drive, get my license. And then there's job hunting. After that follows job. That means work. And that means I was spending a lot less time in front of this computer. This, even though I have ads on my videos and I am making some money, that is nowhere near enough to support myself off of. I can't, I can't do that. This cannot be like my hobby and my life. It, it has to stay as a hobby for now. And I don't know if I'm ever actually going to make it my life. Because, eh. Because once I consider it a job, it's probably going to become a lot less fun to me. And that's the only reason why I'm still doing this. This is fun. I love doing this. I love getting content to you guys. And I guess that's why I get angry when I can't get this shit to work for me. Because then I'm failing you guys in a way. And that hurts me. That hurts me a lot. I can't, I can't like live with myself when I do that. So I'm having to balance out. I have to put my priorities in order, which means this scale it is benign. It's worthless, benign. So I then have to come to with, come to terms with. I have to take the easiest path for now, or change something. And right now, the easiest path is more clear than changing something. Because if I change the way, if I change some, I I literally have to take into account everything that that will affect. I can still try to make two videos a day. It's hard. I've said that several times now. I'm trying to reorganize my thoughts and figure out what I've gone over already. I may have to splice this a bit. But you understand what I'm talking about. There's just a lot on my plate and more coming. And then there'll be an actual schedule that I have to fit work around. But you understand that part. There's only going to be so much time I can put into the videos. Now, I said earlier I have a bootleg setup for venting my computer. It's time for an upgrade. And I'm not talking about just the computer. There are several things that need an upgrade. So, besides my computer, which I want to get replaced with a tower, the thing about the computer, it's, it just doesn't have enough power, and I lack the ability to actually take this thing apart, upgrade it, overclock it. I can't do any of that. I don't have the, I don't have the skill, I don't have the brain to do that. And that's why I'm looking for a job at Best Buy. They'll teach me. They'll help me out. They'll they'll techify me. And when it comes to upgrading, because that shit's difficult. Next, camera. Obviously, this thing I'm using, I love it to death, and it's great for some things, but long-term recording, it is not good for. Mm-mm. Not good for that shit at all. And it's seen better days, obviously. So, that camera, I want to get it replaced with, like, a really, really good webcam. That way it's just hooked up into my laptop or my computer, my tower. That thing, which is going to be beast-like, it's going to be my baby because I'm going to build that thing myself, maybe. That thing won't die. That thing won't be running on a battery like that at all. No, that thing will go forever as long as I have the hard drive space to record. Lastly, well, I think lastly is the capture card. I'm getting tired of Pinnacle. Getting tired of its shit. I'm tired of the fact that I can only record in 480, even though I render in 1080. I mean, is it 480 that I record in? I have no idea at the moment. I have no idea. It's just 1020, 480. I'm confusing myself right now. I'm just having a headache and a meltdown. Oh yeah, Sony Vegas, I want to get that too. Photoshop I want to get. I, there's a lot of stuff on my wish list. And it's all and it's all still based around you guys and YouTube. Like, I want to do like speed draws and just... But all this stuff requires money and job I need. Not to mention colleges around the corner too, which I have yet to get to that topic. You see what I'm talking about? I can't do this. This is a... Mind fuck. Ah, losing my mind. Ha, ah, I gotta, gotta add some humor to this video because I don't like being a sourpuss. Don't like it. I can't do it. If that, 
if I let something like this ruin my mood, I'm done for the day. I'm done for the day. So I gotta keep it positive in, in some form or sense by adding humor relating to my sanity. But, j j college. College, okay, yeah, college. College is the next step. College won't be until spring. Luckily, I will be starting my first semester from home. Maybe even my first year from home. I will thankfully have a tower computer by then, because I'm pretty sure I'll be a workaholic, like my mother. I'll probably be working two jobs and still working around YouTube, because I need to build up a buffer and I need to save a lot, because college is going to just deplete my savings. So, I'm working on going to DeVry, going to get my degree in gaming, because I want to do more of the coding side of gaming, but I also want to help out with the art side of it as well, and the actual configuration and modeling and all that stuff. I want to help out with just about everything there is in the field, but I may, I mainly want to be able to create a game myself. Like, just from the code all the way to the art, to the gameplay itself, to the storyline, I want to be able to create a game. That's my goal in the long term. So, that's why I'm going to try, because I've apparently got the ability to do just that. I've got the grades, I've got the attitude for it, and I've got the path set in front of me. All I have to do is just build up a little bit of build up a little bit of a buffer, which I've done. I've pushed it off until spring so I can get some money rolling, so I can do, get some upgrades and get ready to just do this. Because as soon as I get into college, and some of my spare time is going straight to that, taking those courses. So job, college, and then YouTube when I can. So. I'm going to have to apologize if videos eventually slow down, but life is saying, Hi, Rose! Guess what? You're Cameron Morton for a while. Here, have work. Here's school. Hey, you forgot to pay your bills. <laughs> Buy electricity. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Fuck. <sighs> See what I mean? <laughs> life in a nutshell. Get ready for it it'll rape you if you're not careful. So, I'm sorry. Magna Carta needs to be put on hold. I've decided out of the two, Magna Carta is harder to record. Star Fox is easier, and I know how, I know generally how long the game is. I think it's about 40 parts, maybe. Maybe. I don't know for sure. But I'm guessing it's not going to break 60 or 70. No, I haven't. I'm pretty sure it's not going to go that high up. So I'm, think, I'm aiming for 40, maybe 50. So that'll be done very shortly, and then I'll probably be doing a few small projects here and there. But once life really kicks in, I can't promise anything, but I will never stop YouTube, guys. I will never stop it. Just keep that in mind. So, as usual, I'm Fallen Rose. You haven't seen the last of me. I'll be back.